Hey everyone, this is Steve Watson at Watson House Studios. And I've been kind of going over the power conditioners. I'm, uh, my studio's torn apart right now because I'm working on power. I'm putting in double conversion um, UPSs down there. Of course, they're not going to live in this building in the control booth. They're going to live somewhere else. But I wanted to talk about this Furman AC215A power conditioner. Some of the uh, power conditioners you get, let me see, I'm going to go up and show a rack right there. That's a that's a, a one rack U power conditioner live wire. I have like three or four different Furman ones as well. And when you open them up, there's not much in them. You know, there's very little actual protection. And I just feel like we kind of get ripped off on them. However, here's a product that I really like. And this is this thing sells for about 150 bucks on like sweet water. And it's really nice. Now it's the construction is amazing. It's very strong. And um, the AC that goes in here, the power plug goes in here, you actually have clips that hold it in. You screw it in and it won't come out, which is great. And you only have two plugs, but it's enough to supply quite a bit of equipment, as you can tell, 1,200 watts. But when you open up this unit, this is what I really wanted to see. When you open up a power conditioner, there's some conditioning going on. There's some, um, I would imagine this is a ferrite, uh, ring and the ac power goes over it which is what you would expect there's some other filtering as well yeah i opened up one of the other units and i did so the other day um and i opened up one of my other firmans and there was like one capacitor in it and that's it so you know i feel like this you know this unit it's really nice and i think you know if you want to get some some good power conditioning this is a good product i would recommend this highly i've used it and i really like it and if you're like me, you've had problems. I've had some noise. I've had um, RF interference and just other AC noise. And so I'm really spending the time to clean it all up before my next session, which is next week. And um, so I'm hoping to get it all done by then. As you can tell, i got a ways to go. My studio is pretty torn apart right now. It's kind of a mess. Look, I'll show you this. What a mess, right? But it's, you know, that's just part of doing this work and I actually love it. Anyway, so I hope you uh, take this recommendation. This is a pretty nice unit and hopefully this will save people's time and money in purchasing products that aren't quite as good. Okay. So if you like this channel, please subscribe and I'll be posting more. Okay. All right, everybody. Take care.